Hey guys, how's everybody doing today? Hope you're having a good Sunday. Man, I've already been all through the depths of Central Florida and back to Alabama, all that fun stuff. Not Central, uh, Panhandle. Anyway, so today, I'm gonna be doing New Belgian Voodoo Ranger Imperial IPA. So, uh, it says a rare blend of choice hops creates an explosion of fresh cut pine and citrus flavors for a complex, rich, and delicious finish. That is to be determined. Got our green flash bottle in there going. Right, so pours a fairly see-through uh, golden color heads a half inch quarter inch white a little creamy a little cream up there uh, right off the nose you get the pine you get some fruit it's a grapefruit coming through Straight away, there's pine right up front. Um, as it gets to the back of your tongue a little bit, you get some lemon, maybe a little lemon zest. Um, and it's in, in the grapefruit in, that's in there is grapefruit meat, not the rind, which is good. I like that. Um, you can smell what I'm thinking is probably Simcoe hops. In the pine, um, I will say that I'm not tasting much malt. Uh, I got lots of lingering pine, which is great. But when somebody labels it, labels it Imperial IPA, I expect a strong balance of malt and hop. This does not have that. I, if it was me and I was labeling this beer, I would have probably went with double IPA. This double IPA tends to imply a bit more of um, hot forwardness, whereas Imperial typically implies more of a balance, so you can taste plenty of malt and you can taste plenty of hop. Um, not that it's bad, just I don't particularly agree with the labeling. But I didn't make the beer, so fuck me, right? Good lacing. Um, yeah, so the beer itself, tasty, uh, very easy to drink for Imperial. I'm not sure what the ABV is on it. Uh, 9%. Didn't taste like 9%. I will give them that for sure. Um, as far as it goes, it's an easy to drink one. I like the pine, the grapefruit. Um, Yet again, I don't really want more maltiness, but anyway, make sure to like, subscribe, and share. If it doesn't involve beer, you probably shouldn't be doing it.